So I got this from Keymailer and I wanted us to check it out. It's Flight Tracker 3D. So you can zoom right down in. You have loved ones on the flight. You can track them. It's got numbers. What kind of flight it is, what altitude they're at. Um, if you click on it, it'll show you what kind of plane it is. All the information you would need, wind speed, everything. The cool thing about this thing is, is that if you come out, look how many look how many planes are flying at one time over America, Europe. You can search the whole world, even into Russia, Japan, China, Australia, India, the Middle East. Africa, South Africa, even down in here, <clears throat> Belize, Mexico, Canada, one weird one right there, what kind of plane is that, just sit up there, that's uh, Canadian, I guess I just want to see mountains, um, <clears throat> with snow on them, the cool thing about this thing is though, is if you come up here and you hit U, it only shows you military planes. And I mean, all the military planes. Like this one, this one's Adam 36. You got this one with no call sign. The C 17. This looks like a Chinook. Yep. It's pretty cool. No call sign. No picture either. <laughs> uh, C-17. But you can look all over the world for military planes. These are just military planes. No call sign. No call sign. No call sign. There is a lot of no call signs. Another Chinook. Got this one up here doing whatever the hell they're doing. The only place you can't look is the uh, North Pole and the South Pole, right? No. You got these guys down here with their little planes. It's cute. That's a little plane. Got a couple of big planes. This video won't be long, but I think it's kind of cool. You put it back to regular. Your mom's flying out of, uh, you know, say Philadelphia. You know her thing. I was flying out of New York. Most of them are flying out of New York, probably. This one's flying out of this one's ass. Where do you go, Spirit? Well, got a package. You want to track it? Boom. Right there. I mean, you can track so much stuff. It's not funny. Look at that. Washington. All these planes. There's no call sign in there. You see that? This little Cessna looking plane. I mean, it's pretty cool. I like it. It's kind of nice for when my family flies. I can see where they are, see if they're good. Mm -hmm. You can see where planes come from, where they go. Fort Worth, Dallas. It's a lot of planes. Look at that. These ones are right down in the tarmac. This one's getting pulled in. This one's coming off, just landing. I mean, it's, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's, if you find one that's going to be leaving, I mean, look, this one's about to land. This one's getting ready to land. Look, look, look. If you're in the Dallas Fort Worth area, 
This plane is about to land. Well, actually, technically, it probably landed about an hour or two ago. So, I mean, this is this is pretty cool. You can check it out. I'll leave a link for it. And, I mean, I don't know what some of these other ones do. What is this? Home reset. Okay, so it shows New York. Yeah, I mean, there's so many flights out here. This is all the tracks. Let's see, you got labels. Get all their labels on them, call signs. This one's got more labels. Multi select, so you can select the flight probably. Oh, look, FedEx. It's probably throwing packages out the window. Um, you got. Let me take this off. This one is patience mode. So this is the one I selected, and that's the one it showed. So if you select a flight, Delta, and you go into here, it'll only show that flight. So you can track it. And if you want to watch it, if you're a watcher, you can just watch it from start to finish, you know? Let's see. Uh, let's see. Random plane. You can hit random plane. Oh, what the hell is that? That's not a plane. Liars. <laughs> um, see? Random plane. Bam. Random plane. Bam. Bam. Bam, 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 bam. Random planes everywhere. It's a little Cessna looking thing. And then you can follow it. You can set it on follow. Uh, let's see. You got more stuff down here. You can search a plane if you know the the flight, the flight number and everything. And this is all the stuff, the legends. You can turn the sidebars off and you can make it bigger. Down here, you can track a flight. So, bam. You can track a flight. Um, you want to track, see where Air Force One is? Bam, I bet you can. If you want to track where Air Force Two is? Bam. You just type in Sam 909. <laughs> Obviously, if the president's on the plane, it's automatically Air Force One. Um... You want to track military planes, see what they're doing over your neighborhood, your area, bam. It's like that. Adam 36. Got it. This one's a C-30. C-17. The little plane. Watch a cute little plane. Look at that. That's so cute. Little plane, huh? Tells you their altitude, speed. This one's just showing it's flying across the, co the country. It's at 36,000 feet right now. It is at 412 knots. It shows you the bare much of pressure, the, the magnetic delt, whatever the hell that is. <clears throat> Roll. Let's see, I think this is on the ground. Is it? No, it's at 3,100 feet. So it's flying above a base, probably. Oh, that's one of the little ones. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So, Dolphin, this is uh, Fort, Fort Rucker. That's what this is. This is Fort Rucker. Um, I remember Dolphin and all that uh, this one is out of virginia beach this one's from somewhere else I mean, if you zoom right down in it shows you like literally roads i mean this is it's pretty detailed Adam 36 is coming in hot. 
from Omaha, Nebraska. Look at that thing. Real-time tracking. It's a hell of a drug. <laughs> I'm just joking. Real-time tracking right there. You click on it. Let's see. Uh, W135 to Boeing. Be safe, crewman. Uh, let's see. Looks like they're heading towards Kansas City area. At 474 knots. They're boot, they're boot scooting boogieing. There's so many flights. And you can even <clears throat> track in 3D. This is the military plane, Adam 36. And it's got a 3D render of tracking. And you can do this for any plane. So say, you know, you know, grandma's flying home on, uh, say, a flight out of uh, New York City, you know? Let's say this one. We go down here to tr track flight. Give it a few seconds, maybe a minute or so. It'll render everything up. And then boom. Look at that. That's Airbus. There's New York City over there. I feel like I'm right there. I feel like I'm in New York City right now. I think we're about to land. I think we're going down for landing, guys. I mean, it's pretty cool. It shows flights around. It tracks the flights around it. So if you look around, you can see other flights out there. Look at New York City over there. <clears throat> you can zoom out if you want a wider view. This must be what, New Jersey? You can zoom in for a closer view. Feel like you're flying in a tail wing. Like some modern day cowboy. I mean, you could hold on at 136 knots, I think. Maybe. <laughs> Probably not. Oh, it looks like he's raising back up. <clears throat> Must have been going too fast. Well, they're not landing right this second. I mean, there's a lot of stuff this can do. That's kind of cool, you know? 3D rendering, light tracking. Look at all the airplanes down there. Look at them all. We're going to have to circle back around. <laughs> They just go right back and boom. You ever want to visit somewhere? Just get a top aerial view. 
Let's see, where have I not been? Never been to California. Uh, let's uh, let's see. Is there any on a good flight path? This one. You shouldn't be on a decent flight path to go right over. Let's see what this one looks like in rendering. Oh my god. Let's see. Oh, look. It's almost like I'm right here in California. Look at the clouds. I don't think that's Hawaii right over there, but I that's maybe it is. I'm not sure. It seems a little close. But regardless, look, look at you can see the the trenches in the ocean. Beautiful beach. Look at that. Look at all that beach right there. This is the place. Go back out. We'll find another flight, you know? Uh, let's see. The Bahamas. Look at this. You ever been down to the Bahamas? I haven't. Looks like there's an airport there. Guantanamo. Cuba. I ain't never been to Cuba. You been to Cuba? Maybe you have. It's pretty dope. Look at these places. How about overseas? Or if you're overseas already, how about your country? You know, I've always wanted to go to Ireland. Want to see Ireland? How about Dublin? Look at this one. And, oh, this one's on approach, too. We can track that one. Looks like a bigger plane. I heard it's beautiful over there. I heard the drinks are good, too. <laughs> oh, look at that. What a green, beautiful plane. That I like that. Being Irish, I like that. Look at that. It's pretty good. Green hills in the background. Let this thing land at a pub. You know what I'm saying? Look at all the green plains. You got this, pilot. No, just tempting. To, it just landed. I'm guessing I can't watch it land. Maybe they stop for a photo op. Oh, is he going back up? Well, either way, it's a very beautiful line, eh? And that was not an attempt at some accent from the region. I mean, this is this is really good. 
I'm guessing it's using like Google Maps. It's going a bit slow to be up in the air, don't you think? <laughs> 20 knots. Oh, that shit's got good brakes. Damn, those air brakes are crazy. Look, you've got the shadow down there. Them air brakes is crazy on these planes. You're going 13 knots. Dang. Like watching a plane in slow motion. It's at negative six longitude. Look at that. This guy's just basically floating. Let's take a screenshot of that. Can we? Can we get a screenshot of that? I don't think so. But that's okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. You guys see that? I thought it was going to crash. See the break everything I touch. All right, guys, check this. Check this out. It's pretty good. It's called Flight Tracker 3D. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Um, it's one of the random videos I've done. But, you know. Got a fun. Have a great.